Some serious okay, so, so here's here's the thing. Environmental stuff. So Okay, so some guy did a study and determined that it takes it's more polluting to the environment to walk to the store than it is to drive to the store. And the basis for this was basically it took a certain number of extra calories to add a walk to the store to your day. Okay. And in order to have those calories of energy, you had to eat a little bit more. Okay. And food to be to produce food and deliver it and then has all these numbers all that, that stuff, cost all has that. all these environmental costs to it okay. as opposed to the environmental cost that you would uh, save by not doing that but instead using uh, petroleum to drive to the store and back so the number of the number of numbers that had to be crunched to yeah. make that assertion yeah. sounds like it's just insane mm -hmm. like all of the very i mean i don't well sure but if that's your that's your area of study i mean I now, guess that's I, what and doing. i hear i mean you know it's like i I, I'm not dismissing it because it, it might be reasonable. I mean, it could be legitimate like, I'm to always, break down the numbers. I've always but. been one to be like, there, so things aren't always as it seems. For instance, uh, 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 cloth diapers versus disposable diapers. Cloth diapers need to be what, uh, manufactured just like disposables, but then they also washed, need to be washed dried. every time. So yeah. there's a certain amount of environmental impact for washing. But they're it's just a I different saw. kind of. <laughs> it's just a different kind of environmental impact. Exactly, it's, and the same thing. Paper plates. One's necessarily better. Or paper better. plates versus you know we use a lot of paper plates at home. We also use regular dishes. And the thing is, boy, really, if there's a week that we're really busy and we decide to use a lot of paper plates because the food we're eating lends itself to that. I mean, we end up like not needing to run the dishwasher for that week because mm. we didn't get enough dishes to do it. Yeah. And really, the amount of paper we used was, you know, just a little bit. And then that paper came from trees, so that paper going into the landfill, which is where it would end up here in Colorado, um, goes in uh, to the landfill. And I mean, that's I mean, what what's better to put in a landfill than something that's going to completely decompose very quickly? Um, of course, the funny thing is, you know, every, every once in a while I get one of those. Um, Things with the cans, little plastic rings around, mm. you know, and they say, "Oh, we got to cut those up because the dolphins get their noses stuck." And I, I said, the those, po "Those poor dolphins in the Colorado landfills. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, they already got enough problems because they're in Colorado landfills, <laughs> as opposed to being in the ocean. That's to have that is an extra. In, in this country, environmentally, we're cool, thanks to our forefathers. We're cool. What do you mean? Yeah. yeah what, uh, like, what do you mean by that? Yeah. Well, the, the, I, I mean, I'm sorry, but you can't just give us that. They reduced the population of grass country crunching methane machines. Cows. American yeah. bison. Oh, bison. Yeah, they, okay. we got rid of and all those. And there were millions and Pesky millions and bazillions bison. of them. And thank yep. goodness they're dead. They're gone. You can imagine the amount of methane they'd be pumping into That's the That's right. Well, we replace Chain. them all with cattle. Yeah. yeah. Well, but well, I'm, actually, and I'm doing my part in the environment. I try to eat as much beef as possible. No, we didn't replace <laughs> them with cattle. The population of bison was, was just uh, was outrageous. Oh, yeah. so, so it was even. They, they couldn't so, even walk. I mean, they were just like this just, mass of... You got, you got to, you crossed the Mississippi, you went about five miles, amazing. and you couldn't get through it the was, bison. It was like they were in an day. elevator or something. Yeah, yeah, and there were brave settlers going out and, and popping the them. The first ones you had to shoot just to make a path through to, the, to California. Yeah. <laughs> and, uh, oh. So, yeah, so it, it, it's funny. People, I always, just, people just make I always argue wild that, you know, plastic you know, bags, and people say paper or plastic in the restaurant, in the supermarket. And I always say, okay, first of all, Plastic bags are made from what? Plastic. Petroleum. Which is made from oil. Yeah. Where did the oil came from? It came from in the ground. <laughs> so <laughs> it's going to go back in the ground. I mean, there might be a petroleum source in the future from these landfills, from all the plastic that decomposing. Oh, that's right. Or, or something. But, but the thing is, and they're so thin. I mean, did you ever take one of these things and really try to crunch it up? And also, no, another thing I noticed about uh, decom decomposing is you take one of those paper bags they have in the supermarkets. You get it caught in your bush, right, in the side of your house just before winter comes. You don't get to clean it up. And you get a plastic bag caught there because the wind blew it there. And then it snows and you forget about it. And then the spring comes and then you look and the plastic bag is almost gone and it's so brittle you touch it. it, cut, it, has it comes cool. The paper bag's still there. So I'm thinking the plastic decomposes better. Just from personal experience. So if you want a sturdy bag to move canned goods, get paper. Well, the, the, other, the, other, <laughs> the other option, too, is that, um, you know, there's that whole reduce, reuse, recycle thing. I'm more of a fan of the reusing. Like, well, yeah. all of the grocery bags, that's like my trash can liner in my bathroom trash. I use trash. it to scoop dog poop myself. Well, I, take it with. I mean, that works, too. But the and then after too, I, I use it to like scoop dog poop, the helps. next thing I use it for, no, that's it. That's, that's it. Line. It's a one-time um, thing. But, but you know, it, but it makes a good like small little bathroom. But there's so trash many trade-offs. Right this environmental thing. My point is, there's so many different trade-offs. Yeah. You know, 
One thing, it's oh, this is bad really for the environment. It's hard to really Washing your dishes or using paper plates worse. Is yeah. disposable diapers or washing the, the is cloth. Is driving to the store or walking to the store? Walking to the store. I mean, you know, there's so many different things. And it all comes to the down to the fact that um, there's something I'm not, I don't know about. Because I'm not an environmental engineer. <laughs> <laughs> That's why you do computers. But you might be. Which isn't are, even slightly environmentally friendly. Thedailyblog.com. <laughs> Talk to you later. <laughs>